Hello everyone, in this video I am going to tell you how to create a reusable input component in react.js Yeah, let's start Here I already created a react project and also I am running this project Okay Here I am going to create an input field in this component Its name is input component Okay I am going to use this input component in this detail form Okay Here I am going to call that input field for a multiple times And I am going to get the value from that input field yeah let's start here first i'm going to create a input i'm just going to create only one input okay and uh, yeah i'm going to get a name names also we need to get as a props okay here just get name and value and placeholder And also I'm going to create one state there and I need to set the state value from here to there okay so that state name is set val okay I just make this yes capital yeah now everything is fine before use that props value here I just create that state here const our state is set value okay so value i just paste that value use here i want to get a f name initially it's empty and l name okay sorry yeah now we created a state now yeah now this is fine and I just copy this name paste it here just press enter and yeah here value values this one okay and placeholder same I'm going to copy this and paste it here sorry copy this and I'm going to set the value here okay on change first I'm going to create an event and paste that state here inside state I just add a val because we need to set the input field value for a multiple input fields so that I need to make the dynamic set okay so here I just add a spread the val this val existing input field value because we set two objects I mean two input field values in one state right so that I just spread that existing value I just go to set the specific key so paste here I just copy this e because now i'm going to get this value from this input field okay dot target dot value now our input component is ready i'm going to use this input component here okay our state everything is ready right here I just paste that component name and import it here it's imported here okay and for that component we need to pass four props value so one is name just copy this and paste it here second one is value so just pass this value dot f name okay and placeholder is first name and on change okay on change we need to pass the state what we get yeah same state name we are getting as a props so I just pass the same name here and pass the state inside this yeah this is our state 
this name we need to match here okay so that i just make it set state or uh, you can use some other values here states here is also states and here too okay you need to match this value to this so yeah now our input component is ready we are passing a props also whatever that component required okay sorry i just copied this my keyboard is not working properly yeah i just create one button this is submit and here on click i just add a handle click copy this and i want to create one function for this const yep here i just console the this state okay just copy that here paste values now everything is ready now i'm going to see the output yeah this is our input okay and i just go to console basically we didn't get anything if i click this submit you just get a empty value because this input will are empty okay so we need to change the f name to this one okay l name and here too and this is also here too okay last name oh. now everything is ready now the state value is different right yeah now yep i just go to type one yeah this is two just click submit button yep it's working properly we get a value in this first name is one last name is two right I just change this to coding comics just press it. yeah i got a value in this input field yeah in this way you can reuse the component for a uh, multiple times just create only one input and you can access that input from anywhere in your project okay yeah this is what i tried to tell in this video i think this video will help you bye bye